Spring Street Smokehouse embraces classic Q, like full slabs of ribs and juicy slices of brisket. But I'm not here for ordinary barbecue. I'm here for never-before-seen barbecue. A bacon-wrapped meat monster that would even make Dr. Frankenstein hungry. Cajun stuffed chicken. That is the ultimate meat witch right there. Huh? Oh, look at the oozy cheese, man. Bacon, it's cheese, it's spicy jalapeno, it's yeah. smothered in spicy barbecue sauce. Bacon is my true love. You and me both. <laughs> Thank you. This pork-wrapped, jalapeno-stuffed, cheese-filled creation was the bacon brainchild of Dan Patterson back in 2005. Today, it's his son Chris continuing the culinary legacy. So when you think of barbecue, yeah. you don't immediately think of bacon. I think that, that brisket and pulled pork are the, the, the gold standard. But we also do stuff in a way to sort of differentiate and try to create some unique stuff, like this bacon-wrapped chicken dish. You see the... The pigs in my eyes right now. <laughs> I can't stand around salivating any longer. I'm heading to the kitchen where Chef Max Enriquez brings this bacon sensation to life. After first dicing up onions and jalapenos, Max preps the chicken. And we use thighs, of course, because a little more fat content stays mm -hmm. together better. It doesn't dry up as much as you would with the breast. So the dark meat's got a lot more fat content to it. Richer, a little more succulents. So now, how do we go about making these beautiful packages here? It all starts with a ladle. We make about 80 to 160 a week, so we need to figure out a way to do it fast. But what kind of bacon are we using here? It's very thin, and it's got a pretty good high fat content. And that is important. When you're wrapping something, you want to use thinner bacon for that. So you can actually get it to stretch a little bit, have that nice seal. As the fat melts, it'll kind of shrink wrap, kind of a natural basting that'll create... It's like a mobile. I got a bacon mobile hanging above my baby's crib. The bacon jumped over the brown shoe. <laughs> oh, I gotta try one of those. Can I try one of those? Absolutely, chef. Okay. Four pieces? Twelve pieces? Oh, one more right here. Thirty-six pieces? As many as you want, chef. With six slices of savory bacon, we add butterfly chicken, three chunks of pepper jack cheese, diced vegetables, and then Max lets me wrap it all up. How's that look? You know what? Yours looks better than mine. I'm a little upset here. <laughs> <laughs> it's like a perfect little bacon-wrapped chicken dumpling. We're done with it. Send it to the smoker. Absolutely. After 45 minutes in their little red smokehouse, Max brings that drool-worthy ball of bacon onto the flat top for one final crisp. And then it's taste test time. center stage here. It's all stuffed chicken, but the bacon is the star. The bacon really elevates the chicken. I don't order chicken when I go to a barbecue joint. In my past, it's always dried out. That chicken is spectacular. So moist, smoky, sweet. Mm. Salute to the uh, Spring Street Smokehouse. That's fantastic chicken. All right. <laughs> and even better bacon. <laughs> That's a wrap on bacon-wrapped chicken.